but yeah, no, like rock, definitely throw throw your like um reviews up in Discord if you want. Like go for it. Like the thing is is like it's one of those things like I if I can if people you know that's why I have like the streaming uh stream thing where people can post their streams when they're streaming because like yeah like 100% want to use my platform I know my platform isn't big but you know if I can use my platform to help people out I'll do it yeah um rude oh that's right too this run's gonna be with gun gun run yeah hey Bador. Yeah, Sinkatsu. Sinkets. Um, so I would say probably the relic we want to go with, because I don't think this gun is really like long range or anything. Kind of tempted by this one, because this becomes just a damage buff, and it seems like it might be good. You know what? You know what would be ideal? Probably Athena. Hmm. Mm, without damage. I think I'll go with Athena early on because Athena is like getting getting the ability to reflect makes a big difference. Um, damage control, damage control. Going to do me any favors here. Can I? Oh, I can up it more. I don't know. Like, what is the heat gauge gonna truly give me? Greatly succeed it. Like. I don't know what I'm gaining by taking the heat gauge, choose any condition, uh, get out, use it. yeah. Like, some of, the, some of these aren't too bad. Ooh, 400%, 400 percent damage, no thank you. All foes have movement speed bonus. Uh, each mid boss encounter contains plus one armored foe. Hmm. Most armored foes have perks. Um, there's one here. One less option. No. You know what? This is my first time using the gun. I'm not going to take any. Hey, Retro! He gauge gives you new bounties with each level, so Titan Blood, etc. Oh, okay. Hmm. Though, to be honest, my OC is my waifu now. I finally... <laughs> mascot design I like with the poster in Discord. Do it! Yes! Uh, okay. Hi, everyone. Time for gun. Thank the gods. Okay, we're opening with Athena, because I wanted the ability to reflect. Nix has indicated you possess a list of prophecies from the three fakes. I've such a list upon Olympus here. It seems to be connected to your own, as several prophecies already are fulfilled. Isn't it such an honor to urge fate along? Hmm. Uh, your special dash can deflect, that's what we want. Your wisdom guide me. Oh shit. Gotta, re gotta remember how to reload. You haven't used the gun yet, so there's no real reason. Yeah, turn up the heat. Agreed. There we go. It's weird having a weapon that requires reloading. Um, nothing wrong with it, just that it's definitely not what I'm used to. It's also an interesting having a weapon that auto fires, so it's kind of interesting. Where now? Hmm. Hmm. Ah, uh, yes. It'd be very bad if mortals figured out how to build a railgun. Agreed. Oh, whoa. Yeah, it's chaos and it's super early, so of course we're gonna go with chaos. Going in. Yeah. Do her, and 
Hmm. Oh. Uh, your special deal 100, 101% damage. Interesting. I'm gonna probably lean this one. Seems like a good option. Oh, Nectar. Yes, Nectar. Let's go. I feel like there's gonna be some kind of like hammer skill for this to like auto reload. Whoa. Uh, hey, this isn't too bad. I could see getting used to this. It kind of definitely has a little bit more in common with like the bow. Uh, I think you're using the gun variant that increases damage when you. Yes, it does. Uh, hey, Nathika, your brain feels like it's coming out your ears. Yes, I've had those days. Been having a few I've been having those days a lot lately, honestly. But hey, it seems like I'm maybe my I'm moving towards a more regular schedule soon, so that'll be good. My brain could use it, honestly. I've been like trying to run some like different like Adjustment. I've been trying to adjust when like I'm streaming. Probably for the worst because I've been trying to adjust it so that I stream for like five six hours, then, uh, then uh, I nap for four, and then I stream more. <laughs> and it turns out that isn't working for me <laughs> for some reason. I don't know why, but it isn't working. Thank you. Thank you. There we go. Running, running Senketsu today. Um, oh, yeah, we want that. And, yeah. Ooh, Archimedes. Yeah. But. Humans need sleep, not naps. Uh, yeah, as I'm learning, because as I've tried to run this, like, um,. As I've tried to run this, what's happened, what I've quickly discovered is I am able to do it for a day and then I sleep for 12 hours. <laughs> so it's like, this ain't working for me, clearly. The curse of chaos has been lifted. Okay, we've gifted, yeah. You met Athena earlier, I guess. I'd never trade my bow for all that pomp and armor, but I guess to each her own. Hmm. Alright, attacks deal more damage. Yeah, we want that. Straightforward, but it gets the job done. Uh, it's not actually that warm here. It's been raining and windy all day. But it's been nice. Oh. Slot. There, easy. That's what you get. Oh shit! Uh, I think I've given him a drink. The gates of your father's realm were filled by Kim. Now I know that seems perfectly ordinary on the face of it, except there's something more. I wonder if you know the reason why. Hmm. All right. After death defiance, deal more damage than encounter, which could be good because it would be 30% more for when we're fighting redacted. Um, your special inflicts doom, which we are going to be using a lot. Uh, since this actually, you know what? I kind of really like this one. 30% is a lot, though. I think I'm actually going to take this. I will keep fighting. I'm not planning on dying, but it's going to be good for when we do. Um, yeah. When outside, yep, it's fall. Yeah, we've had frost here already. I think our frost happened back in September. Crushed. Oh. 
Oh, okay, so... We're gonna just... There, good. The underworld's power. Has our, um... Is our curse expired yet? Good, it has. Okay, we need specials again. Uh, we're gonna heal up. Hit the spot. And I guess I guess we're good. I don't really need anything else. Palm, palm up. Yeah. Oh, now our specials do big damage. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm about this. Yeah, I love it. It's like playing Elfeld again. <laughs> there we go. Uh, we're in the middle of a heat wave. This is the fourth this year. Oh gosh, oh, that's a lot. That sucks. Oh no, it's a hammer in a double room. I mean the hammer for sure, but yeah. You made an Elfeld combo video? Do you play Elfeld too? Oh my god, we do have good taste. Look at us. Look at us. Oh, 100%. Check it out. Very good. She's your main. I'll check. Look at us. We just we just have good taste. We need rock. We got this. Yeah. Okay, here's here's the big question. Like, do you have a sub in Guilty Gear? Who's your sub? This will be interesting. See that exagriff? I'm actually. Well, I didn't really have one. Okay. Okay, jam. That's fair. That's fair. Yeah, I I go between. Uh, my soul's probably my better sub, but really my backup is usually Ram. Ram's actually the farthest I went in tournament, even though Elfelt, uh, Elfelt was, um, my Elfelt's much, much better, but that kind of happened after I was running, after I was finished tournaments. You use your special three times in rapid succession, that sounds amazing. Your attack bounces to one additional foe. Or is who I'm maining his drive? Same. Yes! Look at us. Look at us. Me? <laughs> Oh, it's okay, Bador. Don't worry. Don't worry. It's okay. You know what would be... Mm, what would be fun? Watching a completely non-horror movie in Horror Month. Yeah, you could do that. Those exist. You could you could do that too, anime. Yeah, R Ram looks really fun. Like, the thing is, is I've always enjoyed playing characters that have, like, a lot of, like... Um different things that they can play with um and have like um but like I also enjoy like rushdown and I'm like okay they've kind of converted ram into sort of a more rushdown direction I'm kind of about it so cuz I I found the way ram was structured she wasn't as um tooly or like you know you couldn't you could play around with stuff but it was really Really, setting blades had to be done like in very specific fashion. Otherwise, people would just knock them out. Hey, Charles. Oh, <laughs> oh, thank you. Uh, gosh, I don't know what I want here. Your attack seeks the nearest foe, deals 10%. Uh, I kind of feel like Ricochet might be the best option. Although Triple Bomb is actually I have trip. I have 110% boost of my my so, uh, special. But no, I'm gonna be playing Ram too. If they add Elfelt back in, maybe I'll try Elfelt, but Ram is, Ram is where it's at. Yeah. Yes, I do. <laughs> um, gotta have it. Gotta have the, like, life fiber. Um. Oh, antioxidants. Whatever those are. Okay, we'll go 
visit Athena. Let's see what I really want and hope to get ABBA. Oh, ABBA's definitely... I wouldn't put money on it, but hey, weirder things have happened. Like, I'm still blown away that Angie's in part of the core cast. Like, that blows my mind. It's like, what? Are you kidding? I always wanted to get into funny games, but I think honestly I just uh, like cute girls and nothing wrong with that. That's a good reason to get into fighting games. Not a bad reason to get in. Yeah, no, that's too, super legit. Like, I don't know. When I originally got into um, Blaze Blue, like I loved Tao and I was like, yeah, I love Tao. Like, it's about the characters, right? So it's something that like, if you like cute girl characters, there's nothing wrong with that. Uh, okay, time for fishing. That was way too early. Damn it, fish! Oh. Special, s special strong can deflect. Death defiance makes you impervious longer. Uh, resist damage. Uh, we'll do just general defense, I guess. Put down smash. Yes. We meet again. <laughs> what? Why did you get the rail? Do you know what you have? Where are your customary weapons? I sort of know what I have, in as much as it's largely responsible for getting me this far. Would you like to see a demonstration? <laughs> Jeez. Yeah. Yes, I would. I always have, as a matter of fact. Hmm. I was supposed to say, I have the ability to deflect. What am I doing? That's a really dirty way to do that, but I'll do it, I guess, anyways. <laughs> wow. Kinda loving this. Honestly, super sloppy, but it's done. Whatever. Uh, let me catch up here. I believe, um, yeah, yeah. And Angie was in uh, plus R, but not in Exerd. Um, it's the only reason I got into Grand Blue. <laughs> hey, that's totally fair. Yeah, there's like. I still don't know if I'll ever be able to get into Grand Blue or not. I think it's just like a hair to, um... I look for fighting games that have like, kind of... What would you put it? Like... I like a layer of slime to my fighters. I've said this before. I like a layer of slime to my fighters and... I just feel like... I just feel like it is missing in Grand Blue. Grand Blue plays things really like straightforward and dry for me. Yes. Like Guilty Gear, there's some like garbage you can do and I look for that stuff. I like I like a little bit of trash in my fighters. That's why I'm not a huge fan. I mean, there's definitely trash in like Street Fighter, but it's one of the reasons that I was like more repelled by Street Fighter is it's just it's like, damn, you mean I have to learn fundamentals? What? <laughs> what even? Um what do we even want here? Um, you know what? I'll take the cosmic egg. Might help. Mischief is literally a term. Yes, mischief! There we go. And I suspect that Strive is going to have a lot less mischief in it. The only fighter I ever got into was DOA, and I think it was uh, 
that's the wrong kind of slime. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, different type of slime, different type of slime. Uh, compared to fighting games, like Street Fighter, gotcha. Hey, that's totally fair. Like, that's the thing, nobody has to... I like fighting games, but it doesn't have to be everybody's thing. So much for talk, right? DOA is neat, yeah. generally... Oh, interesting, cool. Uh, yeah. There we go. Gonna go down here, yeah. But no, uh, I played Tao and Blaze Blue. She was the first character I really got like invested in, and really the first fighting game I got invested in. Uh, I did play a few fighters before that, but like, I always it was never I was never like fully committed. Blaze Blue was where I started getting really committed. But no, I'm. Probably overall, I am an alpha main though. Um, Ram, Ram will be interesting in Strive, and I suspect I probably will pick up Strive. Um, I do like what I've seen of her. I like the changes overall. I think they're definitely more beneficial to me than like learning all the nuances of uh, dropping blades. Because the thing was, was I guess like the idea was I liked the idea when the blades were something that you could potentially use like in neutral. But like I feel like generally because of the kind of uh, issues with like what you have to give up to use blades makes them really really risky and you really only want to do it when you're like in kind of uh, situations where you can kind of combo with them so it was a little bit of a different idea and it's partly why I like Elfelt because like grenade you don't have to like necessarily give up anything to utilize grenade um, I love Rival Schools and I love Bloody Roar. Those are two fighting games I love and they're super underappreciated. Um, Rival Schools is actually, actually here's here's like something I've thought thought about a little bit. I'm not so crazy about Street Fighter, but I do like um, Darkstalkers and I do like Rival Schools. And I think it's because both of those games, even though they have like nuances of Street Fighter, it has that like little bit of slime that I'm looking for, a little bit of that like um, silliness in there that I'm looking for, and that makes those games better for me than what Street Fighter is typically. So it's a it's a weird thing. Um, although I will say both those games do have their problems. Um, as far as Bloody Roar goes, um, as far as Bloody Roar goes, I like Bloody Roar, but I do think there's also problems with it. Which, if they were ever to do another one, like, you know, obviously they'd have to address them, but you know. Your special is faster. Mm, I to... Oh, that's tempting too. Uh, this could potentially be good. I'm gonna go with this. Nice. <laughs> um, have you ever played Minecraft Dungeons? No. Um, James Dio six is support is dead. Bah. Uh, it happens. Uh, those are your button presses. I mean, like it's all about like the nuance of like learning combos are like that. Um, just float back to her auto summon is great. Yes, I think um I think that's like more interesting to me than having to like set and pull because the thing is is like ram by the like at like kind of mid-level upper level play ram isn't really using her blades in neutral as much as she is just like once you get somebody cornered and or you've got to confirm you're using the blades like in the combo itself because the thing is, is you don't want to give up like your uh moves for the most part hey white how you doing guess what i'm wearing today yeah Yes. Uh, the most I got into fighting games was uh, Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite and Dragon Ball Fighter Z. Oddly enough, um, where I live might be one of the only. It might be one of the last l like living um, places where, or like the last places where you can actually find uh, Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite tournaments. There's actually a really there's a surprisingly strong scene for it here, which is really strange, but it is. 
it's a thing. Dragon Ball Fighter Z, oddly enough, um, kind of fell into a weird spot, like in my own like friend circle. I was May Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite. If I was to play that game, I want to play Monster Hunter, but I don't. Ultimately, I don't know that much about the game. But yeah. Also, something else that I noticed with Ram in Strive that I really like the look of is I like... It looks like um, her blades have like a trait where they either carry or push towards the wall, or if they like hit somebody against the wall, it seems like it does something else. I don't know if it's like a wall splat or um, if it like sets them up for like the wall smash or whatever. I don't know what the deal is with that, but I, I like the look of it. <laughs> I'd have to look closer at it, but then, like, just kind of passing footage, um, I was like, uh, that's a high sword throw. Okay, interesting. Interesting. And I was like, huh. I don't know what, what I'm looking at just yet, but hey, that looks interesting. Low sword throw is normal. Okay, interesting. So, there's... Okay, interesting, interesting. I like it. So, there's some nuance to the differences between them. Uh, but admittedly, I am a little bit of fighters at this point, but I still like them. And the thing is, is that's kind of, uh, I think it was in Ethica I mentioned earlier about just liking the, like, cute girls. And it's like, that's super cool. Like, you can do that. Like, you can, that's the thing with fighters is they're great for spectating, too. You don't necessarily have to be, like, super into playing them yourself just to, like, enjoy the nuances of them. enjoy like the um you know what now that I've started to get a feel for it I'm really liking it I do think it's probably my worst weapon so far but it's still I still like it a lot oh uh, those are some choices oh boy do we ever have some choices I feel like I skipped a chaos gate by accident. That does not the bolt. I do think I need more base attack, though. Very nice. There we go. Uh, the high one whips on crouching. Okay, cool. But it has more like special properties to it. Kind of like Sagat. Okay, cool. Interesting. Oh, I like that idea. Even though I don't have any strong like commitments in Street Fighter. I do actually kind of like how Sagat plays, so that's something. Although typically when I played it, I played Makoto and Jury. Um, God, this is the three-way choice that I really don't like. Um, I think I might go with Artemis just because it's like, um, she's she's not like, um, at least with her, I know that like I'm not gonna fight a boss, and her her stuff is just as good as the other two's, so. Chill might have been nice though, admittedly. That is a lot of damage, actually. Wow.
Nope, don't like any of this. There we go. Yeah, I made Makoto. <laughs> yeah. One of the reasons I haven't played uh, 5. Gotcha. Yeah. I was really hoping when they added Jury to 5, she'd feel like Street Fighter 4 Jury, and it would be at least my, like, in so I could play with friends who were playing it. No, they didn't even give me that. <laughs> she feels... She's incredibly boring. Uh, fire Seeking Arrow. Support Fire. It's epic. I'm not turning that down. Okay, Chaos is around here somewhere. There we go. And we have no heart cost because we took the Chaos Boon or Chaos Keepsake. No. Just play Seth. Seth, I'm kind of interested in now too because, like, I mean, I haven't played five since they added Seth. They have Jerry's body, yeah. Um,. I'm kind of about the fact that Seth has this, at least like they're like, hey, this is an interesting direction we could take Seth. And I'm like, yes. Uh, let me see here. In the name of Hades. Okay. Next three encounters, each time you're supposed to, uh, okay, no. Um, money, oh, that's obvious. Let's shake this curse. Who needs gold when you can do damage? I think it's also a shame that people kind of got stopped talking about Soul Calibur. Soul Calibur, Soul Calibur, Soul Calibur 6 was really good. Um, like, I honestly really, really like Soul Calibur 6. Even though I don't play it as much as I wish I was. But, yeah. They gave, they gave Seth Millia's Secret Garden? What? Really? You hate it 6? Oh, jeez. 5 was... <laughs> 6? Really? Oh damn! This is where we this is where we differ, Rock. Um, I hate it five so much. <laughs> they, and it's it's actually a funny story about that because um, I I basically um, five five is yeah. It's a, I'm not gonna lie. I don't know of anyone that really liked five that much. Love five. Uh, the parries and everything was good. Uh, just defense was amazing. Gotcha. Interesting. Um, yeah, so, like, it's funny because a lot of my complaints about 2, 3, and 4, 5 answered, which was, I was like, finally, finally, and one of the things that, one of the big standout things that I said for a long time was, um, that Soul Calibur des desperately needed to, like, kind of, um, cut some of the fat because it had a lot of like move sets that just had so much access to them that like there was just silly moves in there that just didn't have any conceivable purpose they were either like used in one game and then they had no more use at some point and it was just something that needed to be done and then five comes along and it actually trimmed a lot of the move sets made it definitely a more lean game but i felt like when i actually sat down and played it it was like dang they trimmed out like moves that I really, I actually used, and it felt like, it felt really, really hindering to me, but, uh, and then, like, of course, like, the cast getting kind of, like, sort of half and half, like, a lot of my friends, of course, a lot of my friends have played it, played it since two, and, you know, they, they're like, oh, it doesn't have my character, or it doesn't have this character, or that character, I do remember, uh, being a little salty about the five limit, the, yes, that was, see, that was the thing, was, uh, Mitsurugi, um, Mitsurugi was my main in it for, like, the longest time, and Mitsurugi felt really boiled down in 5, like, really boiled down, like, too much so. Um, some characters lost their mix-ups, yes. Like, I felt like, I felt like they, cl they, like, um, trimmed it down into something leaner, but I felt like it was just kind of, like, a broad stroke. There wasn't really, like, a lot of thought for some of the things that they removed. I didn't like Soul Calibur after 2 until 5 came out. Gotcha. Five just is something that has more more of what you're looking for, whereas like the other Soul Calibur games, I guess, just were kind of not what you were not your thing. Which it's funny because there's things in it which I understand why they're the way they are in five, and it makes sense. But I'm so used to how they were in the older Soul Calibur games that it just felt so weird. And then six kind of rolled back a lot of those choices. Um, yeah, and it was much faster. That was something I liked about five too. It was much snappier. Um, 
but like how to put it um like they rolled back a lot of fives choices in six but some of them felt like too rolled back for me so i can understand someone not liking six so you know and i was like i'll replay it really yeah and see that's my thing too is like i play it with friends but that's about as much as i've ever played it really to wonder any longer. He sings it beautifully around the house sometimes. It has a sadder sound to it than when you sing, but you've inspired him again. Oh. As you've done many times before, from what I know. No. Huh, so it's a hit is what you're saying then. I had a feeling about that one. Sometimes you put some words together and right then and there you know you've got something special. Oh. Actually, I'd agree with that assessment. Soul Calibur 6 is very much Dark Souls 3. <laughs> um, it leans harder into what people were familiar with rather than necessarily what was good, I guess. Um, yeah, up the rarity a little bit. Okay, I'll take I'll take those. Whoops. Okay, a little bit of extra defense. That's that's cool. I'll take that. Yeah, and Soul Calibur Six is good, but like, I don't like. Here's my thing. Here's my thing with uh, Dark Souls Three. I think it's just good. I, I'm not in love with it. I'm not in love with it like the first two games. And I know everybody. Everybody's like, oh, Soul or all oh, eh, Dark Souls Two, but I actually think Dark Souls Two is legit. Like, I do think it was like. Uh, scholars of the first sin? Question mark. That was definitely, I think, better than uh, vanilla Dark Souls. But hey, I'm just gonna say, like, what does Dark Souls three compare uh, comparison mean other than fucking garbage? Oh, no, no, no. I just think it. See, like, the comparison I'm making between uh, like Soul Calibur six and Dark Souls three is that both those games leaned hard into things that they knew people liked about the series. Um, so it's something that uh, they 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 kind of, they're catering, I guess is what I'm like leaning into. Not that they're particularly, not that they're, you know, I'm not saying that they were garbage or good or bad, really, in that respect. Just that the, the kind of ideology behind them, definitely. Like, I, I think that's probably what Bedore is aiming at, too, if I'm not mistaken. Because that, that's kind of what I think about them, I guess. Uh, best game from From Software. Yeah, I'm I'm 100% for Bloodborne. I like Bloodborne a lot. I'll take this one. I guess I'm buying a key. And then we're going to fight a boss. Yeah, I would agree uh, about Bloodborne. I like Bloodborne a lot. A lot, a lot. Get back in the magma and no one gets hurt. Oh wow, that's a lot of damage. Wow, I'm just gonna take all those hits for no clear reason. Jesus, this is really nice for this boss. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> okay, taking those hits, that's okay. That's fair. Oh. 
That's fair, everybody has their own taste in games, though, as far as I'm concerned. It's very rare games are, like, legitimately that bad. There's nothing I feel that strongly about that I'm just like, oh gosh. I guess I guess our this I need to run this run focuses on grenades I guess no more heads. for all, all the three hours that it lasts for. <laughs> Damn, I'm not even kidding. Like I played Bloodborne, I think I was like on playthrough nine, like between seven or nine, one of those two. I'll just tuck that away. And that's the thing. That's the thing. Like a good game can be a short game, and oftentimes I like short games because you can sit down and you can play through them uh, really, really quickly. You know. um, do, 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 do. Hey Tara, I'm in the chat. I have to catch up here a little bit. Correction, the correct answer to the best game from Saw 3D. I've played a lot of 3D Die Heroes actually. That game is fucking hard. Like, there's Dark Souls hard and then there's 3D Die Hero, Dot Game Heroes hard. Cause that game, oh god. The game is good, but technically, yeah, I don't think it's from, from software, but it's like, it's a hard game. Uh, it's a fairly obscure game, yeah. There, also, absolutely abysmal, like, trophy list. Everything hinges on, like, two very, like, incredibly hard to get trophies, and it just kills me. Kills me. Ugh. And there's, like, literally one that's, like, do a playthrough, but be miserable the whole time, and it's like, ugh, I don't want to do this one. <laughs> Uh, personally, I just lean hard into because I know it doesn't matter. No. Wait, why was it published by From Software in Japan, and not here? Um, well, From Software I don't think publishes outside of Japan, do they? That's why usually, um, yeah, I kill a Katie. Um, like that's why usually it's like Namco, Bandai that publishes their games outside of Japan. Or they had Sony do their publishing outside Japan. I don't know. I don't think they have any kind of studio outside Japan for publishing. And they've also, um, like, uh, yeah, Demon Souls was published by Atlas. Um, but like, yeah, no, that's that's pretty normal because it keeps their cut. It cuts their costs down, right? They don't have to have a whole fucking studio over here and manufacturing to do it. Um, yeah. So, um, some devs are just like that. Yeah, totally legit. The thing is, is for the most part, um, from software, like, they're, they're a big popular company, but, like, they're not that big. Have to keep in mind, they only make, like, one game every two, three years, so. Yep, Arc System Works is like that, too. I think I'm just gonna take this. Should be useful. Yeah. For us without... okay. Yeah, it's it's not that uncommon. There's a lot of studios that are kind of of that size. We think of like um from software as being like a really, really big studio, but it's not as big as we think. No. All right. Dang, that has some reach to it. Cool, it's butterflies, don't like these. Oh, I do like sandwich though. What's the best obscure game by a relatively large developer and why is it contact for the Nintendo DS? You know what, I looked at that game so many times, never ended up grabbing it or picking it up, but I looked at it a lot. That's every game, Grasshopper game. Yeah. Tag 
attacks faster. Uh, dash more times in a row. I'm gonna go with attack. Faster attack power. Or faster attack. <laughs> hammer. Now it's the time for hammer. But yeah. Anyways, this, this is really funny, Rock. How many how many characters we actually share across multiple games. It's really cool. Ow. It's not great, but it's a single game. It's the single game that I get the most nostalgia about. Interesting. Interesting. And that's the thing, honestly. I've said this, like, I say this a lot on my stream, but, like, good games are overrated. Like, something you can, there's lots of bad, like, bad games, quotation marks, out there that are, like, totally legit, totally deserving. Ah, gotcha. Interesting. Oh, might be something I'll have to look into someday because it looked it looked interesting. Uh. Oh, sandwich. I'm doing a very bad job making sure these things stay finished off. It originally caught my eye because it reminded me of uh, Earthbound. No. Some modifications to the rail Attack still 40 base damage and in a short spread and you have negative... Okay. Attacks seek the nearest foe. Your attack is a three round burst and you never have to reload. Aw. Interesting. Ten percent additional damage? Or just ten percent of what it was doing for damage. There's a important distinction there. I'd like to know. Whoa, centaur heart, centaur soul. I've never seen that in my in the options before. Well, I don't have any money, so it doesn't matter. Unfinished, like all the best games. Oh my goodness, really? Just unfinished, huh? We gotta pick up the pace a little bit. Cause I gotta get food soon. Aww. Yeah. There we go. Sandwich. I guess we'll do trippy shot. Trippy shot's solid. I don't have anything on my cast right now, which kind of sucks. Mm. Guess we're getting into a fight either way. Yep. You ever make it out of here, short one? I wonder sometimes what it must be like. The outside. No. God, that was a completely impenetrable game, beyond confusing and weird. <laughs> oh, damn. Let's see. Hmm. You've never been outside. Oh, right. The labyrinth thing. You lived in a horrible maze all your life. I haven't seen much of the surface, but it's beautiful. Cold. When I'm there, though, I feel out of place. Hmm. Out of place. I understand, I think. I don't see why you'd want to go somewhere like that. It can't live up to the stories. Why ruin it? Speaking of which... Aww.
Whoa, 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 jumps. Nah, he might be kind of hard to deal with, admittedly. <laughs> Oh, are you kidding? They bounce off the statues? I didn't know that. This is just not going well at all. I need to be taking my time more with this. Oh. Whoa, whoa. Oh shit, that's that's one life. So that there we go. Oh my gosh. This isn't going good. I can tell this boss coming up is not going to go well. Special stronger 20% chance to deal crit. Crits deal more damage to armor. Your crit deals... Your critical effect deals more damage. 22%. We'll do this. We're gonna have very, very, very strong grenades. That's my goal. Grenades that melt. Meow. Eventually moved on, gotcha. There's definitely games like that, and that's a very obscure game, so... God, I need that. Um, this could have been. This could have went a lot smoother. <laughs> For myself, on obscure game knowledge, which unfortunately doesn't get enough play. Yeah, I can relate to that. Did you once wield a spear yourself, sir, in your fighting days? Did I once wield a spear? You could say that I did. I had my moments with it anyway. Even once slew a demigod. It's probably somewhere about. Quite awkward running into those you kill. But in Elysium, it's all taken in stride. Hmm. Ugh, this is a hard call. Next five chambers, restore 30% of your health. Replenish all death defy. Um, Nanny. These are all kind of good choices for us. There's five chambers. That could literally take us to Hades with like a health health surplus. 60% damage for this boss is really good too. 
yeah, I'm gonna go with the health. For this. We might be able to get death to five, like, some other way, so. Oh! It's our boyfriend! It's our moody boyfriend. Who dies first? Max health. We're gonna gift him because we don't always run into him, so. Uh... What, really? Come on, what is this, Zagreus? You think handing this to me makes up for everything you put us through? It's just something I found out there that I thought you might like, fam. Don't think anything of it. Aww. Yeah! Still running from yourself, I see. How's that been working out for you thus far? I'm searching for my mother. You still live at home with yours. You don't know what it's like. No. Mother Nix was like a mother to you too. And this is how you repay her. You should be ashamed of yourself and learn your place. Oh. Seems a little tense. Not gonna lie. <laughs> I've never taken this call before, so I'm kind of tempted by it. Critical, deal more damage to armor, deals even more damage. I mean, I'll take it. Oh, a double room. Yeah. Not yet. Trial of the Gods. Um, it's just easier to deal with. Probably, probably, yeah. I'll drink fountains. Oh, restore, restore all health. That's a really good one. Um, ooh, take less damage in festive fog. That's also really good. I'm gonna take this one now. It might help make up for. I should probably have asked before I started uh, hosting a couple hours ago, but no, absolutely not. Go for it, Troubles. I always appreciate it. Like, like I've said before, anyone that can host, retweet, anything for me, like, super appreciate it, because I can only promote, like, so much through my own, like, channels, and, you know, you know, I always appreciate it. <laughs> I don't remember what Ares does. Oh, right, it's this one. This one isn't that bad, if my memory's correct.
I like how my build is currently built around shooting and then jumping into my own grenades. Yeah. What? No. Oh, well, thank you, Trebles. Um, like, yeah, no, 100%. Like, host, retweet, whatever you want. So long, my yeah. This one is not worth the pursuit, I think, when we can wage a greater one together. That doesn't sound like anyone from Olympus, from what I've gathered. Do more damage. I'm just slaying a foe. Oh, tempting. I think this is probably a better option right now, though. Just make sure I'm getting even more health, basically. Oh god, this run is taking a little bit longer than I was expecting. Um, we're going to... Okay, I have time until... Yeah. Oh my god. Well, no, in this case, those rumors must have been quite accurate. It's just I'm back. <laughs> I realized I didn't want a future for myself that didn't include crushing you repeatedly like this. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, oh, such clever excuse making from one so versed in treachery. Well, if you are indeed contained within this realm, then we shall be delighted to make sure it always stays that way. Now. Oh my god. so much health, but I don't really have a whole lot else going for me. Oh, okay, I've never seen him do that before. And this is getting pretty, pretty dirty. Ow. Okay, one down. Ow. Oh shit. It'll kind of work out. Except for the fact that you immediately. Jeez. Oh, like. oh, he's very vulnerable to the grenades. This is like the worst one. Ugh. Oh wow. Um, jeez, okay, he's super vulnerable to those grenades. I love it. Hey, welcome back, Charles. I still don't know what these are for. Hope you enjoyed the show. Fountain, up to full health. Up to full health, um, 75, 150. Yeah, I could do that. Okay, I'd say we're probably good. I'm almost out of here. We're doing good. We're doing good. I actually thought that was going to be way harder, but it turns out the grenades just do so much splash damage that it goes through uh, what's his face really easy. Oh. Okay, we're going to make this fast though. It's like I have food. Health. Um, do I want... yeah, I probably want the health. Should come in useful. We're just gonna have a whole bunch of health going into Redacted. Oh, there we go. Those grenades are so strong! Oh. 
I kind of love this weapon, but it's probably the one I feel most like so-so on at the same time. Like, I feel like this weapon could go really wrong really easily. But I know it's also because of the way I have it built. Because it's built around, like, the grenades and not the core shot. So my core shot feels kind of exceptionally weak. Even though it's not really that bad, it's just not the damage that my grenades are. Critical effects deal more damage to armor. We're getting not really. There's not really any enemies left that are gonna have much armor. So uh, after you deal critical damage to a foe, oh marked, yeah marked is good. So we want that. Kind of doing roughly the same builds every time, but hey, what works works, right? Proceed to alter. I don't know what that means. But whatever that is, I'm gonna hang on to it. Fucking turning these things into dust. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh. Oh. Anyways, how's everyone doing? What's everybody up to? Oh, jeez. Okay, that's new. Cool. Awesome. Great. This is not what I want at all. Ah, uh, right, gotta remember they bounce. Less damage. Okay, take, so it's just a defensive one. Still playing 14? Oh, alter means you can change the next room reward. Oh! Not in this area, okay. Take less damage in Festive Fog. Um, I'm gonna go with this, because it's. We're gonna be below 40% a lot, probably. Okay, I wasn't in either of those rooms, so that's a surprise. This is sure a thing, ain't it? I missed some money there. Saw that right as soon as I went through the door. Easy enough. Ah, there we go. Perfect. Grab our health. That is a lot of max health. 
A little extra damage, a little extra money. Yeah. Should be good. Okay. Hmm. certain trades and seems unfettered by your father's influence hmm I know what that means it means Charon's like tough as shit Ow. Uh, we need to deflect attacks deals more damage to find resource more health than usual replenish one use yes perfect look at that Delicious. attacks are stronger positive outlook uh, yeah there we go cool okay 100% worth it no. Tells the multi headed hound to let him pass. Thank you, boy. All right, this is it. I think we got this. I'm feeling good. Haven't you had enough? So, boy, did you ask her about how she came to join me in the underworld? Did you confirm all your suspicions then? You didn't drag her down to hell yourself, apparently. You're not going to tell me who did, though I can well imagine. Your brothers got to reign forever on Olympus while you got sent down into the underworld. So they gave you a consolation prize, didn't they? Yeah. You make such accusations knowing next to nothing. Careless as ever. Poseidon had nothing to do with it. He knows even less than you. Who said Poseidon? You her existence all your own. You would be wise to keep it that way. And to turn back. Yeah, flex off your cape and let's do this up. Ooh, that's big damage actually. He's going to be vulnerable to this. Because he's he stays too sta he stays stationary for long periods of time. Oh. Oh. Taking that hit. That's okay though. Okay, he's at halfway. He's over halfway. Oh shit! Really? All oh, right, he has three in this one. That's my bad. Oh boy, this is fucking dirty. But whatever. Not our, not our cleanest. Ooh. Not our cleanest one, is it? Shit, I always forget about that one. <laughs> but I get another 30% attack with each <laughs> with each death, so this is gonna be even better for us technically. Yeah. 
Oh my god, this is so much damage. Holy shit. That was so much damage. Got him. <laughs> oh my gosh. No matter how many times you beat me, we are family. There's no escaping that. Again, I you Bye Hades. <laughs> nice. Hey, we filled every slot for our, like items over here. That's cool. Been wondering when that happened. Look at us. Seven six streak, seven clears. We're doing good. Actually, I'm not gonna lie, the gun was crazy effective against Hades. My weapons can grow even stronger now. I'm honestly kind of I'm weirded out because they're super, super effective against bosses, but against rooms they're just like so so. Oh fish. Hey, we got a trout. Is this a trout? Yeah. Trout. <sighs> no trout in the underworld. That's right. All trout go to heaven. Yeah. Huh. To see this each day. Hey, rain. Oh, it's so bright. Zagreus, it's wonderful to see you, but I need to ask something of you. Would you not visit me again here what? in this place? Both for your safety and for mine. No. For what? Because of what would happen if the Olympians found out. So after everything, you're taking father's side in all of this? No. I am. Your father is no fool when it comes to matters such as this. Besides, all that has happened, it's my fault. I was selfish. And now both sides of our family threaten to be torn apart. No. Your fault? So let's say you never left Olympus. Then it'd be just like you thought until quite recently, I think. That I'd never existed. Besides, they haven't found out any of this. What makes you so sure they will all of a sudden? Mm. Nyx may be veiling you from them as she veiled me when I fled here myself. Mm. But even her own powers aren't infallible. Each time you visit me, you are incurring risk. One small slip, and they shall find me. Discover your deception. Go home, Zagreus. Please. No. Go home with me, mother. You came here under false pretenses. I haven't fought all this way over and over again, only to turn back now. No. Oh. You in my life. No. Oh. You just turn me away like this. Oh, baby. Oh, Zagreus. I cannot return. After all that happened between Hades and me and everyone, I just cannot fathom the idea. Besides. The risks we're taking would be even greater if Olympus were to find me there with him and you. Mm. Then uh, you're just going to stay here, alone in the middle of nowhere, in this little garden, forever. With your million tomatoes. Just like that. My son, I know you've made hard choices and sacrifices to be here with me. And I'm forever grateful to have finally met you. This is my home now, yes. Oh, 
how your home is below. Mm. Please, if not for your sake, then for mine. Do not return. I love you, Zagreus. Goodbye. Oh. Mother, I blast. Oh. Goodbye. Baby. this to me oh. I was looking all over for you <laughs> you startled me your highness they might be pomegranates you might be right it's a lot of pomegranates it's you be on your way Zagreus I have an audience with Lord Hades in a moment an inquiry into my recent absences what are you worried about, Fan? You've never given him a reason not to trust you. Recently, I'm not so sure. Whatever you're doing, it had better be worth it. Does he have to teleport away like that every time? The ever faithful Cerberus remains <laughs> not baby. Fastly in his spot. Ah, that makes sense why it's so they're pomegranates. It's a great way to get the last sword. You're not wrong, Retro. Not wrong about that. My records indicate that you've collected earnings based on some of your accomplishments there, boy. I suppose you need an income of your own, having decided to cut ties and all. Oh my god. What, you mean the bounties that you've offered up to anybody capable of beating Meg and all your other guardians out there? Don't you think that puts a lot of undue pressure on them, knowing that you've turned them into targets? They must do better than they have, else they shall be replaced. If they're to grow in their respective roles, they have to know their weaknesses. And so do I. That you collect the bounties for it matters not. Hmm. What about the bounties for vanquishing you? Who's your replacement going to be? <laughs> Enough. Get out. Oh my god. I always meant to ask you, Orpheus. Where did you learn to sing like that? Was it really Apollo himself who taught you? Oh, I, I learned from many different sources, Agrius. That is, before all of my inspiration started coming from a single source. I credit my accomplishments to her and to Apollo and the gods. And to considerable time spent practicing. Mm hmm. It certainly paid off. Makes sense. There must be someone else whose time you could be wasting, Zagreus. Nope. Oh. Cooking's one way to pass the time. Enjoy trope. Oh my god, we got a diamond for that. Yeah. I'll swap a fucking trope for a diamond That's any day. You did it. Yeah. Hmm. I'll take that. Approved. Wouldn't mind an extra helping of gemstones while I'm ransacking. Darker my thirst. Meow. My realm for gemstones, be my guest. Okay then. Yes. Nix. What is the matter, child? I sense your distress. Not the specific cause. Nix. Mother doesn't want to see me again. I mean, she asked me not to return. Thinks the risk is too great. Oh. That is a fair enough assessment. What shall you do? I'm going back. Good. Ah. Uh, Nix has got my back. She knows what's up. That definitely came to pass. Oh, perfect. Can't believe Lady Athena's fighting for me. Okay, Goddess of Wisdom. All done. And we're still quite a few keys off here, so yeah. <laughs> yeah. Less yak and more smacking, boyo. Now come on. Oh my god. Oh, it's Bo again. Oh my god. Alright, so I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna save it, and I'm gonna call it for now, because it is 4 o'clock, and I gotta go meet some people for supper. So, anyways, thank you guys for hanging out this afternoon. I hope everybody enjoyed the stream, and, you know, 
afternoon time slot's going to be a little bit different, but I'm going to see what I can do. And, you know, maybe I'll be streaming tonight too. The last couple times I've kind of failed, but I'll do my best and maybe I'll be streaming tonight. I'll make sure to post on Twitter and Discord, so just keep an eye out. And yeah, so anyways, thank you guys for watching and hanging out and hope everybody enjoyed the stream. And I know I repeat myself, I just do that and a bunch of happens. But anyways, catch y'all later. Bye. <laughs> Bye.